The morning after town voting day in Epping, the school superintendent received a call. At 4 a.m. I was told that a voter had been at the high school to vote. And she was and told that voter was heard saying know. they were going to quarantine for the next 14 days after coming into contact with someone who is sick. That's when she decided to close the middle and high schools for cleaning in fear it could have been the coronavirus. The elementary school was open as usual. I felt like I made the right decision at that point in time. Later this morning, Valerie McKenney spoke with a voter in question who says the sick person they knew was just diagnosed with the flu, not coronavirus. We are working very hard across the state uh, to do everything we can to avoid community um, transmission of the virus. Um, and so that I think is what drove that decision by the local school district. Education Commissioner Frank Edelblue says schools can look to the state for help in these types of situations. Certainly I am available quite a bit to the schools to help guide them or direct them to the right resources or even to provide them feedback or help weigh decisions with them uh, so that they can come to good conclusions for their communities and for their students. This parent has kids at both the elementary and high school. He says he supports the super Superintendent. They wanted to make sure everything got cleaned out and they got the wanted to find out more information about the person who may have had contact with the coronavirus. So I I agree. I think it was the right call. Students were able to do schoolwork from home today and they will be back in class tomorrow. Reporting in Epping, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.